Fucking Jesus. That, that got me. <laughs> I'm sure that happened in the demo, but it still got me. Okay, good day everyone. This is Tormented Souls. Um, I did play the demo of this a while back. And yeah, I'm looking forward to this. I, I'm going to be doing this uh, very slowly. I'm going to be going through this game. I'm going to be taking it all in. Uh, stuff like that. So if that's not the sort of playthrough you're looking for, then fair enough. Um, yeah, I'm going to be like looking at the scenery and stuff like that. Uh, with that said, this first part, which I'm probably going to make an hour long, I believe is it's going to be exactly the same as the demo. So I probably won't be going too slowly through the first part, but we'll see. Uh, who knows with me? Uh, anyway. Let's uh, start a game. Tormented Souls. Oh, uh, I can already see some screen tearing. That wasn't happening in the demo. I hope that's going to disappear, but we'll see. Interrupted doing our makeup. A letter for me. I never receive letters. Uh, yeah, so yeah, it, it is pretty much the same as the demo. So, uh, John Doe to uh, from Wild Burger Hospital to Caroline Walker. Oh, in Canada. Don't, know if, don't didn't remember that it was set in Canada, but okay. We got here. Pictures of two girls. Oh, interacting with it hurts my head. Uh, you just think you can abandon us here? It's been two weeks since I received that letter from the Wild Burger Hospital. Oh yeah. Since then, I haven't been fine. I can't get out of my head the image of those little girls. I can't sleep. And when I am able to fall asleep, it's only to dream horrible nightmares. I need to know what's going on. What's the meaning of all of this? I'm going to the Wildberger Hospital in hopes of finding some answers about this strange photo. I need to know what's going on. Okay. So we've got our mission. Very nicely lit hallway here. Ouch. Private restroom. Yep, so pretty much the same as uh, the demo so far. Okay, let's uh, start examining stuff. Why was I connected to the respirator? So you can breathe, probably. Respirators and oscillators. 
Let's go. Let's get clear scoops. What did they do to me? Well, you're about to find out. Right, the boss has took your eye. Oh no. <laughs> oh God, what have they done to me? You could have done such a horrible thing to me. Why? That is a pretty horrible thing to do. Um, what we got here? William Wahlberg's diary. Okay, so today is the happiest day of my life. After all the suffering we've endured for the past few years, Maria, my beloved wife, has blessed me with two beautiful angels. Uh, wait, uh, no. but there is more. After all this time, she has returned to me. It's not our name, Maria. Uh, anyway, she looked at me with her eyes wide as if she had not seen me in years like she was w waking up from a dream. That is not all. Something odd happened when I checked the watch, checked my watch to find the exact time at which the first baby, Emma, was born. As I opened the lid, the glass cracked and the hands utterly stopped. I do not think this event to have some meaning or other I am not a superstitious man but Maria insists that it is a sign she has started using the hour as her lucky number and uses it for everything okay All right, one second okay that seems to have helped um, right so what uh, oh god um An old pocket watch. There's a latch on the crown. Okay, so twelve thirty-five, and uh, I believe you can't go this way, can you? No, you can't. Some things I will remember from the demo. Some things I won't. A combination padlock. So say. effect sure let's go with that um, right oh, I didn't actually check what was in here an old rusty wrench the jaw size is adjustable nice we can use this as a handle Oh, just got an achievement. Escape. Oh, look, there's the controls. Inventory, maybe? Yeah, I think that must be in inventory. Okay. Ah, <laughs> tank. It's telling you you've got tank controls. Uh, but an interesting way of doing it. Uh, I've actually seen somebody... Be What's it say? Do not let shadows embrace you. Oh, that's right. I think um, the dark hurts you in this game. A bit like a uh, song of horror. East Wing Corridor. So some of this... I will just be speeding through until we get to the part that I hope we haven't done. Um, I will be leaving my... What's that? Okay. My... Um, demo playthrough on up on my channel so if you do want to see my first impressions of the first part of this game that's where to go interesting artwork waiting room oh okay Okay, clipper nails can be used with a nailer. 
Huh. Some more artwork. What does she have to say about it? The Nightmare. Painted by Henry Fusely. Okay. It depicts a woman in a deep sleep with a demonic incubus crouched on her chest. The recreation is amazing. It almost looks like the original. Ooh. What have we got here? A report about Tits Moot Tribe. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. According to the latest archaeological discoveries on Winter Lake Island, the Tis Moot tribe resided on the island for more than 500 years before being discovered by European settlers. Proof of this is an ancient underground cemetery found deep inside a cavern on the island's shore dating from the 10th century. More than 286 skeletons belonging to a 10 year old children. What? Oh no. Belonging to 10 year old children have been unearthed so far in the underground cemetery. All the bones were buried in pairs, and experts suspect that there were twins buried together. That these were twins buried together. Okay, so somebody didn't like twins. A vending machine is out of order. It's locked, it appears to be open electronically. Something to interact with. We don't have the handle anymore. The the wrench. This doll gives me the creeps. So look at it. It's a bit creepy in it. We care for you and your health. Okay. Blood donation not marathon. Okay, examination room. Oh, that's right, this is the save, save room music. Very nice. The left side of a plastic cart. A file of morphine treats minor injuries. Uh, doesn't appear to be a zoom. I think I said that in the, in the thing. One to four grain, okay. It's covered in blood. God, it reeks. I don't care to lift the sheet. Oh, that camera freaked me out a bit there. A detailed mannequin of a human torso. Old files, nothing interesting. Seven inch tape, I can use that to record information. Okay, how many did I get? Uh, just the one okay I'm not actually going to save it but when you do save it she does say a little bit of blurb which is quite interesting you know she says like um, I'll show you at some point but um, one out of seven children are abused how many do you know don't let this happen again you're suggesting I abuse them How many do I know? How rude. Um, okay. Breastfeeding the best for your health. It's locked, it appears to open electronically. Okay. So, side on the generator this way. What we got here? Uh, 6th of June 1963. I was terrified of what William would do when he finally saw my naked skin, but my fears were unfounded. He accepted me even with the scars on my back, left by my father's whip. On my back, left by my father's whip. Yep. Uh, William asked me why he did it, of course. I explained that the pain was to redeem me, redeem my sins. William would never look at my father in the same way again. Yeah, he shouldn't fucking do. That's disgusting. Um, whipping people's back. Uh, a map of this area. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, is that that little speaker icon? I think that's the save. And then we've got the key. Um, I never found out how you solved this puzzle in... Was that picture there in the demo? Hmm. I never found out how you solved this puzzle in the demo. I just brute forced it in the end. Hopefully I'll... Um... Oh, uh, oh uh, we've actually got a map. Okay. I don't remember picking up the map in the demo. Uh, how do I... Nope. How do I view it? Do I have to do this? Okay, it's a bit annoying if that is the way, but anyway, where, where are we now? So we are here. So we're going for downstairs. We can go upstairs to the maternity, newborn and delivery rooms. Right, let's try going upstairs first. Judith Bedding, Olo fans painted by Gaviago. Oh, it depicts Judith beheading the Syrian general in his tent after charming him. Oh yeah, the re looks like the original. Okay. Look from the other side. Okay, well I guess we're going downstairs. Heart attack? <laughs> okay. I don't know why I laughed at that. I think it's because it's on the floor and it's like... It's just, anyway. Um, more nail cut? Yep, lovely. What have we got here? Uh, Dr. William Wildberg. Since the patient's health is extremely delicate and the transfer could worsen their condition, I would advise against transferring them to the new hospital. The patient has cardiac inefficiency and requires an immediate transplant. The patient passed away at 11.34pm due to cardiac arrest. At the time of their death, they were holding onto a metal object with the rapid onset of rigor mortis. I have been unable to remove it from their hand. Okay. Uh, a hex end socket. It's missing a handle. Basement East. Uh, okay. Mm hmm. <gasps> it's been mutilated. What the hell is going on here? Uh, oops. Huh? Oh, the statue's wearing a gas mask. Fair enough. Noise a noise. You're not wrong there. Okay. Not from the other side, that's the morgue. No smoking. No no worries. Oh Dun dun dun. Okay. Look on the other side. Go, 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 go. This one. Oh. Just got into frame. X ray room. to you a person in a wheelchair with knives in his hands was chasing me oh it's you don't you remember me i'm the town priest we met here in the chapel only a couple of days ago okay what i'm sorry i don't remember you i certainly don't remember coming here before 
Oh, that's right. I thought that maybe I was one of the twins. Uh, I think by the end of the demo, I didn't think that, but I don't remember why. I see. Perhaps I'm mistaken. I'm old and get confused every now and again. What is going on here, Father? Where is everybody? The patients and the hospital personnel have been transferred to the new hospital in town. This old mansion has been left pretty much abandoned. Why are all the lights off? I don't like this. Anything could be lurking in the dark. I feel the same. Something evil is happening here. Something wicked that hides in the shadows. Is there a way to turn on the lights? The old generator has been playing up. It happens sometimes. Go to the end of the hall and through the door that leads to the generator room. You can restore the power from there. Okay, end of the hall through the door. I see. I'll do that. Wait. Take this with you. It's not much, but it might be useful. It's dangerous to walk around the mansion unarmed. So many present evil references I Thank could make you, there. Father, but what are you going to do without a weapon? My child. I have this. The Bible in my hand, yeah. God protects me. Mm -hmm. uh, a nail level modified air pressure tank to increase the power. Okay. All right, well. Let's pick up these that I just saw in the background. More nails. How many do we have now? 17 plus 10 in there. That's pretty good. Uh, biohazard X-ray. So this is... Oh yeah, it's the X-ray room, isn't it? I'm looking for information about the two girls in this photograph. I see. What do you want to know about them? Everything. Anything, really. Oh, okay. I was hoping to find some leads around here. I don't know what you're looking for, but I can tell you these girls are no longer with us. No. There was an incident some decades ago where they disappeared, never to be found again. Mm -hmm. That sounds terrifying. Indeed, if you want more details, you could try the mansion library. Not actually what the subtitle said, but whatever. I'm sure you'll find something there. Okay, so library. Thank you, Father. Take care. So generate room first in the library. Okay. Let's see what else we've got here. It's not plugged in. What is it? It's not plugged in. Yeah, but what is it? I don't know. What's this? A well-worn crowbar. Oh, okay. Uh... Oh, I can use it as like a melee weapon, I guess. Well, let's keep the lighter out. Uh, let's do some examining, actually. Uh, an old gas lighter. Uh, yeah, can we use it with the nail? I think we've seen most of these. Oh, not combined. Yeah, I think it's... Yeah, it tells us most of those when, it, when we pick them up. Okay. Actually, oh, do we have any other files that? Leon's diary, pocket watch, Maria. And. Oh, there's the controls. See, it says X the dash right, but I've been holding X occasionally and it's done nothing. Oh, hang on. X and directional pad. Oh, so by default, if you use the left stick, it. it well, it does run, but if I use... Yeah, there you go, look. And then if I push X, it does that. Okay. That's good. To, good to me to finally have worked that out. Uh, what have we got here? Maria. Another one of Maria's diary. Okay. Today is one of the happiest days of my life. William came running into my room, searching for something. Uh, his eyes travelled around the room giving me no more than a few seconds of attention but then he looked at me again his eyes open wide William came to me and put his hand on my forehead he pressed his fingers into my wrist and he looked at me for a few seconds unbelieving his voice faltered when he spoke we're going to have a baby 
he said. I felt sick. William took the rest of the day off. He acted like a child, laughing and speaking of the future, holding my hand the whole time. That night, we heard a noise coming from the underground. It sounded like metal being struck over and over. We could not find sleep until the early morning. Fair enough. Okay, so crowbar. No, uh, let me, there we go. Cool, lovely stuff. Generator room. More nails for the nailer. Oh, I will take it. I'll take them rather. Uh, gas naturel. Oh god, do I remember this puzzle? I don't, but I do remember you'd need one of these to get. Because there isn't, as you can see, there isn't a handle there. Yeah, there you go. Valve missing. Oh. Maintenance crew logbook. There's an issue with the electric generator. The pressure on the gas must be exact for it to be, for it to ignite. The correct pressure is written on the control panel. Oh, well, there we go. It's gonna hand feed us the puddle. A map of this area. Okay. A map. Why are some areas green and some red? Well, if it's like um, Resident Evil, it means that the green areas are complete of all items. Oh, there we go. That's a valve. Or valve appears to have fallen off something. So maybe that is what it's signifying. Whether an area is complete or not. So I know I'm rushing through this part, but it's, I say it's because I want to get to part of the game that I haven't played. Oh, I should have read what it said on the control panel. Damn it. Um, and as I say, I will be inspecting the surroundings and stuff like that. Uh, ten kuglom. Ten kuglom it is. Let's go. Oh, come on. Right. So we need to get to there. Well, that goes down by two and a half. One and a half. One. It's two and a half. One and a half on one. Okay, so that went up by four and a half. That goes up by a half. Surely I could just do this. Oh, no. That. Is that right? Well, I guess there's only one way of finding out. Oh, hang on. Oh, it goes down to nine when you... Okay. Cheeky, cheeky thing. I think I kind of remember that happening now. Mm-hmm. So. so. Take off that half and add the one and a half. Oh, no, wait. Going the wrong way. Hmm, okay, Let, let's put it back down to five. So, what I got up to? Two. Okay, and then we need to minus one and a. No, we just need to minus a half, don't we? Oh, we don't have a half. The lowest is five, so. Go up by half. There we go. Uh, I'm not sure I, I, I said it right out loud, but I, I knew what I was doing in the end. Um, with that last bit. Um, okay. Electricity is the achievement I just got. Um, 
I never know whether to call them out or not because I know they can be immersion bre ah, breaking for some people, but it's part of the game. People want achievements these days, so. Hey, bitch. Okay, is he dead? No, he's not. Uh... Oh, actually, can I reload? I can. I can have some of that. There we go. First enemy down. Uh, how do I... Oh, that's right, I have to go in here, don't I? So... It just... Oh, look, it's, it's still red. Okay, well, well, we'll ignore that for now. So if we go up here... That door was locked. Can we go in there now, though? Let me turn the generator on. Not from the other side. Okay, so no. Uh, get out your... Just to be safe. A lighter. Do not run. Well, I am. <laughs> oh, whoops. Um. Okay. East wing corridor. Uh, let's go to the library. I don't know where that is, though. So. Radiology. Pharmacy. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh. Maternity ward. Photo from the nurse standing next to the patient. Oh, yeah, I made a comment about how neither of them look particularly happy, do they? But especially the mother. <laughs> she, very, very upset. Um, anyway. Uh, Lucas Houston, evening staff, electrical maintenance, quarter to ten. Nurses told me that there was a lamp malfunctioning in the maternity ward. When I turned on the lights, I could see that one of the bulbs was, was on the wall was indeed flickering. As I was getting ready to change it, a man came out of nowhere and grabbed me by the shoulders, pushed me back with strength unimaginable for someone of his age. He told me not to touch it. I didn't want to argue with him, so I simply left. I cannot stop thinking about it. Why did the old man prevent me from touching it? I should check it out. Uh, I believe... Well, I won't say anything, just in case anybody's watching this who hasn't seen... Uh, her chest was left open in the middle of the procedure. The heart is missing. Her fist tightly clenched from rigor mortis. Okay, that does nothing. Yeah. Nothing happens. Well, I'm not sure nothing happens, but... There we go. That's the one that flickers, as you can see. Uh, water is switched off. Okay. Oh, God. Maybe I should use tank controls. At least then I know I'm going in the direction I want to go in. Uh, I've, I've switched the D-pad for the moment. Uh, oh! I will take it, thank you very much. Okay. Oh, what was, what was that? Various mannequins are kept under these sheets. Okay. Right, well, let's do this. Fucking Jesus, that, that got me. <laughs> I'm sure that happened in the demo, but it still got me. Uh, 
Quicker in the mirror we travel. Shoom. Little room. Okay. Oh, uh, immediately forgot that I was trying to use the D-pad there. Okay. Maternity ward. But slightly different. Uh, a lot of morphine treats minor injuries. Oh, what the fuck was that? There we go. I want this out. Ay, bitch. You're dead? Oh, I'm in caution. Oh, I'm Caroline. Okay. Oh, yeah, Caroline Walker. That's right. Fuck you, bitch. Alright. Let's uh, reload the nailer. Surgical tools. They don't appear to be in good condition. There's a hole in it, it's just cavity. Oh yeah, I need the other heart, part of the heart. Don't remember where I get that from. Oh, I'm sure we'll come across that at some point. Oh, oh god. Did you see the screen was flickering? I can't open it. Flickering then, that's um... Because, as I say, if you spend too much time in the dark, you die. Oh, interesting. Mm. Won't budge, I need to force it somehow. I don't know if we ever solved this in the demo. Nothing happens. See, the reason I use it there is because it goes blue. But I can't do anything with that, apparently. Maybe I've got to grease the wheels up or something? Oh, there you go, it's too rusty to move. Yeah, so we need to find some sort of lubricant. All right, well, let's go back to the, the uh, uh, maternity ward up here, and then we will go to the other room that was electronically locked, which I don't remember where it is, but I'm sure I'll find it. Um, okay, oh, not that way. I'm going to go this way. What was that? Okay, she's not... She's not aiming at anything yet. Not yet. Ah! Okay, that was an interesting uh, death. Oh god. Um. Actually, where was the save? Uh. Oh, okay, it's in this room. Oh, this room I wanted to go in anyway. Because uh, I think, was it the dentist room that was electronically locked? Don't remember. How come it's still. Red in the private restroom. Let's go and see if we can find anything that I can pick up in here. Don't let the shadows embrace you. What does it mean? Uh, okay, now we have to do here. Oh, they don't let me. Um, Hmm, maybe that's not what the red means on the map. No, perhaps it's just weirdly colour coded or something, I don't know. Anyway, let's go to... Let's go save it so that we can um, hear her little 
blurb that she says when you save it. Oh god. Uh, oh, they spit blood at me and that hurts apparently. Bitch. Uh, oh, I, hmm. Okay, so it didn't actually heal that much. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Oh, bitch. Okay, that's one down. He's It's not dead though. Oh, I am though. Perhaps I should have saved it. Fuck me. Exit to main menu. <laughs> well. Okay. I'm back, bitches. So fucking... Oh shit. <laughs> Fucking Jesus Christ, okay. Oh. Right, so carrying on. Um I don't I, I didn't come in here when I've uh, when I redid all of this. So um, this is the first time I'm in this area again, so I've got to pick up a just all different creeps. Hang on. Wasn't it over here last time? Oh that is fucking creepy. Uh, but so yeah, I um I've still got to pick up the um, stuff in here and as we're here I am going to save it because I haven't done that yet because I haven't been in this room to save it yet um, I'm sure there's stuff that I missed picking up yeah I'm going to have to take this I'm sure there's uh, a way of like combining it with something to make it a bit more powerful but I can't be walking around in danger that's um Oh god. Um Oh let's see what she what she has to say. Uh, and that one. An old magnetophone. It looks like it works. Recording my progress might be useful if anything happens to me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a bit late for that. My name is Caroline Walker. I came to Wild Burger Mansion seeking information about two girls in a photograph I received in the mail a couple of weeks ago. The last thing I remember before losing consciousness was arriving at the hospital and entering the mansion's main hall. I remember pain and then nothing. I woke up sometime later connected to a ventilation machine. And my eye had been removed. Why? Why would someone do such a thing? I don't know what the hell is going on in this place, but I need answers. Every time I close my eyes, I see those girls. Am I going insane? There we go. Uh, should I? Sure, I'll say I, I, I got an achievement there called Registry. Um, okay, well we can go through this door now over here because it's no longer electronically locked. Dentist room. Okay, so what have we got in here? Oh, another bad guy. Such good tools, they don't appear to be in good condition. Right. Oh, 
Oh, you... I should, I should take note of that when they do that wind up, because that's when they do the um, the east, the spit that, that does damage. So whenever they lean back, as if they're gonna, if they're gonna spit, that's exactly what they're doing. Anyway, X-ray images. I don't know why the camera's at a weird angle, but all right. Right, we're here. William Wildberger's diary. So. Of September 1941. I crept quietly behind my father. The clock struck 1 at 1.30 a.m. I saw him enter the mausoleum after placing three elements of some kind on some kind of board. He went through quickly. I followed him at a distance, trying not to make a sound, for I did not want to be caught. At my mother's tomb, my father sank his knee and rested his hands on the cold, sculpted marble figure of my wife. He began praying. I felt guilty following him, seeing the cold and calculating man move this way. What? Right, okay. I was worried. I was about to leave when Father stood up and, appro and approached the angel statue. Father's marble tomb slo slowly moved slowly to the side and exposed a narrow staircase leading into the darkness. He climbed down the stairs. I hesitated for a moment. My legs not wanted to take another step, but I was able to stand and follow him down. Once inside, I heard metallic sounds and the echoing of running water. A few moments later, I bumped into a ladder. I climbed down and found myself in a long stone tunnel covered in pipes and sewage. I saw my father's silhouette turning a corner and hurriedly, hurriedly followed. There's a lot going down, isn't there? Going down, down, down. Before, my, before me appeared a huge metallic door and a group of men wearing strange suits like those worn to protect from radioactivity. Each carried a giant hammer. My father joined the group and they received him by hitting their hammers together. A hospital bed on each side of the group carried what appeared to be bodies covered in sheets. My father put one of the disturbing suits on one of the disturbing suits. In my frightened stupor, I loosened a brick from the wall and it smashed against the floor. With a sound of a thousand buildings crashing down, I could feel their eyes turn to me as I fled back the way I came their guttural voices screaming to catch me while I while they hit their hammers on the ground. It's an interesting way to d describe I was being chased, but okay. Treat my injuries. Um, I'm in fine now. Drugs cabinet neatly arranged. Not anymore. Oh. Oh look, the other side of the heart. Okay, well let's go put that baby's heart in, shall we? Uh let me just get this out. You have a moment to get it out anyway, you know, the 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 um screen goes all fuzzy and then you can hurriedly get out the lighter sort of thing. But I just want to get it out just to be sure. Oh wait. Is this the room? Yes, this is the room. Right, I need to go to the other side. Little room. Little room. Okay. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. Ramping up. 
And it stopped. Okay. Oh, I need to turn it on first. Ta da! A metal handle. It's missing a socket. That's right, we've got it. We can do that in just a moment. Okay. And she's gone. Wonder if the baby will be gone. Let's not worry about that though. Let's go to uh, the place that needed the... Oh, I haven't killed that guy down the end there yet. I should probably do that just to make sure he doesn't like surprise jump me at any point. Um... Oh, not examine. on their back and hmm gas masks oh anyway uh, da -da 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 -da. it's from here oh there Main hall. And this is where the demo ended. So now we are in a new territory. Okay, what we got? Some wakeful signs. So yeah, this is where the game is going to slow down significantly uh, because of the way that I'm planning on playing it. I'm, yeah, I'm going to look at things in the background. I'm going to look at, the, you know, uh, an old piano. Sadly, I don't know how to play. So I say, if this is if that's not for you, then by all means, welcome to go elsewhere. Um, What's it say? 300... No, I can't read that. Oh, actually. No, it says a 100 punks. <laughs> Not sure that's correct. Probably reading that wrong. Um, oh, look, a pram. A pram of nails. Just what I always wanted. Okay. An interesting, like, uh, broom thingy, my bobber there. Oh, I wasn't expecting to be able to open this door. Chapel. Oh, god damn it. Get out of here. Anyways, let's uh, have a look. Carry on looking around the main hall. See what we got. Nothing on the desk. So, uh, got downstairs here. Okay, that leads to the door that's locked from the other side. What's this? Okay. Something can be placed here. Something can be placed here. Something can be placed here. Yeah. It's shut tight. I'm guessing that opens with the stuff that can be placed there. Okay. There. 
Oh no. Can't get past the black floor signs. How crazy. Uh, okay, so. Hello, hello, who are you? Nymph untying her sandal. Sculpted by John Gibson. Okay. Apart from the other side. How unexpected. A sculpture of portraying twin angels. One of them comforts her grieving sister. Oh, that's nice. Oh, another door I wasn't expecting to go into. Meeting room. Okay, it's not save room music. But that doesn't mean to say it's not a safe room. Wait, that was a say? Not from the other side. Okay. A calendar. 16th of December. 1994. Hmm. Oh, actually, let me try something out. Um, what happens if I do this? Uh, one second. You'll see what I'm doing in just a moment. Uh, I don't know if I've done this right. Yay, look at that. You can see my notepad. I'm going to make some notes and then I'll um, put it away like that. Um, oh, I need to get my window back up. I'm glad it doesn't um, stop the music or anything like that when you when the game loses focus. Because otherwise that would just make it a bit less interesting. But um, as in me making notes, it would be more annoying than anything. Uh, I'm doing fine, so we'll be, we'll leave it for now. Anyway, what, what, what have we got here? We've got sword and shield. I mean, there's lots of things happening on that shield. Two lions and a falcon and or phoenix rather um oh second floor corridor ah i didn't like that sound <laughs> such a pansy i know what's that picture she's just got her arm resting on the thing um well, let's go back out into the main hall and check the other doors and stuff. Uh, what? Okay, is there something in my way here? I can't actually, it's not letting me interact with anything, like push A or anything. But I guess there's something in the way, I just can't see what it is. Uh, what have we got here? Decorations and stuff, I'm not sure. Not from the outside. Okay, well, let's get back down to the main floor and go through this door. Uh, into the chapel. She's not aiming at them yet. Please aim at them soon. There we go. Oh shit, I forgot, completely forgot. Um, oh, it sounds like there's another one as well. Okay. He, he doesn't sound like he's chasing us though. Sounds like he's quite a distance away. Uh, where are we chapel? How do we get in here? Oh, through there, okay, so. Okay, so there's a door there that needs that key. Um, there's a kitchen down there. Closet, warehouse. Okay. So, uh, yeah, so this is this key is you find in the in the demo, but I can't remember where you find it. Um, oh, look, it's gonna map of the area. 
Okay, just in case you can't work out from the the other map that doesn't tell you where you are, which is fair enough. Uh, I'm sure some people can't. Uh, my sense of direction is not great, but, but I can just about. Okay. Um, it's a shame there's no like quick way of, um, you know, swapping between items. I know they're, they're doing it for like old school effect, which is fair enough, but... Oh, kitchen. Okay, what have we got here? Loads of stuff. What have we got? What have we got? can't read some of that, never mind. Oh Jesus, somebody hasn't done the dishes in a while. It's freezing cold. Okay, so we need to cool something down. Ah, I was going to see if I could put morphine in there. Uh, doesn't fit. What? <laughs> What do you mean? Um, I, I don't actually want to do that, it's just that was a weird... That's not what I was expecting it to say. Wash your hands, please. You won't leave this place. Oh, okay. That's not very nice. Oh, look, 16th of December 1994 again. I haven't actually wrote the, the date down, but uh, the year, but... Charred remains? Are these human bones? What the hell is going on here? Really, that's what makes you question everything, is it? The trash has been left to pile up. Yes, it has. Uh, oh, another door into the warehouse, okay. It doesn't sound like we've got any baddies in the warehouse. Oh, I spoke too soon. That was a chair, wheelchair plate. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? That was... Uh... So he's got a lot of reach. Gotta remember that. Fuck you. And your wheelchair. Yeah, fuck you, Wolverine. Bastard. Uh, what have we got here? Nitric acid. Part of nitric acid that can corrode metal over time. Okay. Oh, it's dark over there. Let's uh, get the liar out. Actually, we need to reload my... I'm running low on... Well, everything, really. Door unlocks. Okay, that's good, but I might go for it just yet. Uh, insert this to write new keyword. An old PC monitor. A slot for a floppy disk. Okay. We don't actually have a floppy disk on me, so. Oh, yes, more nails. Good. Um, okay. Maybe I should tr start trying to avoid enemies. Back into the chapel. Sounds like we've got another enemy. An iron door knocker shaped like a hand holding a ball. Okay. Oh my god, it just goes everywhere. Plus it. Okay. I go wrong, I like exploring, but I, I just, I would like to know some areas, some areas that I can't go into, sort of thing. Anyway, battery can fit here. Okay, battery charger. Okay, is that going to stay on the map? If I... No. Uh, but at least the computer does. Um, do, do, do. 
I guess we can try the studio. It's got a save thing in there. Actually, that could be a good place to save and call it for this first episode. I should say this first episode is going to be longer anyway, so we, there's at least something that isn't in the demo included in it. Okay, so that way it goes back into the warehouse. Okay, cool. What's down here? Okay. What? Stop, stop. It's like shimmer. Is that meant to symbolize that I can move it or is that there's something there? Because I can't seem to pick anything up when I mash A. She seems to get stuck. Like, like you know, she, because she's trying to get into that animation, I think. Uh, anyway. Elevator button is broken. Might be able to call the elevator from this floor. Okay. Does it tell me what floor it's on? Uh, I'm not too sure. Right. Cool. I can go into the studio. That's good. Right. <gasps> shotgun shells? We get a shotgun? No fucking way, that's awesome. Uh, oh, and also an inch tape, cool. That's good, because I say I want to save it in. Uh, I'm going to take a break. And uh, you shouldn't have come here. An x ray image showing a heart. The figure seems familiar. Does it? Hmm, okay. Can we get through this door? Oh, we can. Surface area. Oh, this is a scary area. Let's leave that for our next episode. Uh, I say episode. I, I, I call them parts. And so, oh, anyway. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Um, have a good day, everyone. Have you speak to you soon. <gasps> Bye. I'm back. I forgot uh, she, she says stuff when you save it, so <laughs> let's do that. Uh... Oh, never mind. She didn't say anything this time. Bye.